Why your this marriage or relationship always got problem? Hello, my name is Dr. Chan. Today I'm going to share with you some insight of what could be the issue related to your marriage or relationship that's always having some challenges. Whether you are male or female, it doesn't really matter. But ultimately, we can always see a certain patterns inside a person's life. So which means that every time when you go for a relationship, when you go for a marriage, they always got problem one. Whether is it there's a third party or perhaps the other parties are having a lot of challenges, giving you a lot of uh, challenges in your life and giving you a lot of relationship issues. And this can be identified. Which means that within your chart, that means in a person, if you were to base on the Chiman Destiny chart, you're able to see a certain pattern. That means within ourselves, uh, there's something called the partner, partner box. That means this partner box tells us the relationship between yourself and the relationship in the aspect. Question is, is it a good formation or is it a bad formation? And what happens if you have a bad formation? That means in your life, regardless of who the person is, that means the other party, the, the male or female, whichever that you are going to be with, party A, party B, party C, most of the time, it will be the same situation. That means, if the whole formation is not very good, then every single one of them sure got problem. And because of that, everyone that you encounter will also have a challenge in any way. Ultimately, is this. Can this be solved? Yes, it can be solved. Question is, do you know how to solve it? Before we even know how to solve it, we must understand what is the formation inside this particular relationship box? If you, know, if you know what is the problem, then from there you try to negate the situation. That means identify the problem within the partner itself and then from there you're able to solve the problem. Sometimes it may not be the problem of the particular relationship. It could be the own self problem. That means your character may have a certain situation whereby you do not understand. And you always feel that this is uh, a normal thing for you but on the other party's eyes then it may be an issue so sometimes relationship is not just a one-sided affair it's a uh, it could be you believe that the other party is at fault but on the other hand the real reason it could be your your situation that's creating the problem you see so a lot of times when we i help my students or if my customers to identify we have to be in a very neutral situation whereby we understand okay what is the problem of that person what is the problem of the other person and then from there i did identify where is the real problem because once we understand the real problem then we're able to fix the issue and let's say from another angle is if you're able to see the problem of the relationship or the marriages are we able to solve it yes we can solve the situation it's possible but it takes a few things that means it takes both parties to acknowledge that there's a problem and both parties are willing to come together and solve the problem. And at the same time, there will be a lot of effort, a lot of energy to make things work. Don't expect one person to do the job. It takes two parties to do the job because if a relationship is always about two parties, it's not just one party effect. And don't expect that the person have to do something for you so that it makes things work. You have to do the things so that you can make things work. And both parties have to make things work. You see, so relationship is always about coming together. It's not always a one-sided affair. You see, so we, we don't talk about the third parties whereby there will be ladies or other men involved. But ultimately, we put them aside first. That means both parties, the men and women, are they willing to come down, sit down and really solve the problem amicably? You see, that's the whole challenge behind it. A lot of relationship is always talking about how can you do this to help me? How can you do this to improve the situation? That means it's always about the other party that's trying to make an effort. Then let me challenge you is how do you make an effort to make things work? You see, you have to make the effort to make things work rather than the other party have to make things work. If both parties are willing to make things work, then there is still a chance. If you expect the other party to do everything for you, no. 
in, it takes two parties, you see. So eventually it's this. If you have a challenge in relationship, identify the problem of the semen destiny chart first. That means the destiny, the chart is, is itself. Everybody have their own chart. Identify the problem first. Once you under, understand the problem, then you know how to solve the problem. And from there, your relationship, whether is it just pure girlfriend-boyfriend relationship or marriage-wise, it will improve day by day, year by year. You see, so this is how I solve a lot of people's problems related to marriage and relationship. And thank you very much for watching this video. My name is Douglas Chan.